tonight for dinner it's just gonna be salad let's look in the fridge to make sure I don't want to talk too fast and it's not there so let's go and see work is doing what I wanted to do let's ask the kids let me see honestly what how was how was the steak that I prepared the other day So this is what my pork chops look like. I have water in there because honestly, I start cooking with a little bit more water than oil. I'm gonna add olive oil to that. And then some of my main steak seasoning that I'm going to use, add some of that. And um, definitely black pepper and some seasoning salt. So I've already gone, I just applied some seasoning to the tops of these and then I'm going to um, cook it partially through and then I will flip it eventually and put seasoning on both of them. So while this is doing its thing, because I'm not going to cook it on high for very long because I want this to be soft and tender and kind of fall off the bone. This has bone in and that's how we re that's how I really enjoy it. So i um, just going to cook it a little bit like that and then I'm going to turn it down and cover it with a lid. Cover it with a lid and then it will get turned down and I'm just going to go ahead and start mixing my sauce. Then I'm going to mixed with part water as well. I'm going to add some more seasoning into that. After that I'm just going to um, fry it down kind of like in the sauce with you know with the sauce so but I want it to be very tender and soft generally a, a good a meal like this is really good in the slow cooker but I didn't have enough time to take it out I love cooking it pork and like um, ribs in the slow cooker because then it's just like fall off the bone tender and that's how this will be we made it the other day and it was super delicious let's ask the kids let me see honestly what how was how was the steak that i prepared the other day it was really good. It was really good. yeah yeah what did you I, like about it i don't know i don't personally like the fat parts of pork but the like i really liked how tender it was I know. Even yeah. the I don't. I'm not a big fan of fat usually on chicken, but I like it on all their meats. Yeah, pork fat is pretty good. It's pretty good. So how did you Dad like it, Trevor? Bacon. I really like it. Like, that's not my bacon. My favorite part fried. might have been the chicken, or not the chicken, the pork. The pork. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Really. They really liked it. They gave it a thumbs up. <laughs> oh, baby girl is resting down here while I am cooking. Um. Anyways, back to dinner. So so for dinner, I'm just going to be doing that pork with some veggies because I said I'm going to start my healthy eating journey today. And one thing, I was watching the schmovies um, last night and to be honest, uh, I was a fan of what Dana was saying because it's something that I've done before. She was saying they started eating more, um, eating more meat with veggies and that's basically what I want to do. And I And she was also talking about just how it's... You know, her eating like that is not just beneficial to her. Her family benefits from it too because she's going to not eat healthy and then feed her kids the bad things. And carbs are important, but I feel like the kids can eat carbs like several times throughout the day without, in other areas. Um, they can get, I think, eating a lot of fruits and veggies is beneficial to them. And so if I'm going to focus on eating like that, I think I'm going to do that, you know, encourage everyone because even Aaron wants to be on that journey. We've done it before, but I went through the process where I made meals separately for everyone. Or I always make the carbs and then I say, I'm not going to eat it. And most times I don't, but then there are times when I kind of cave because it is made and it is there. So Tonight for dinner, it's just going to be salad. Let's look in the fridge to make sure. I don't want to talk too fast, and it's not there. So let's go and see. Hi, baby. Hi, baby girl. Hi. She going to say hi. Check out the baby, the cuteness, guys. Check out the cuteness. Her shirt says the snuggle is real, and she's snuggling her little stuffy zebra here made of, I think he's knitted. 
His name is Zodiac. Zodiac and Zoe equals Zozo, which was originally her nickname anyways. <laughs> the cuteness. Hi, anyways, I'm going to do this small package of beans. I think I'm going to have to get Hubby to pick up salad on his way home. <sighs> if I had one of those food sponsor uh, companies like some of these YouTubers, I would have exactly what I needed in my fridge, but I don't. So, you know, got to do regular shopping like the rest of y'all. So the pork is doing what the pork is doing what I want it to. The olive oil in there. So I'm just trying to mix up that oil to make sure it's going through it. Then, because I just want to brown, I just want to brown the sides, and then I'm going to slow kick it. So now we can turn this down to between four and six. And we can start slow cooking it. I'm going to add some water to this baby. We're going to stir. I'm kind of making a cooking video, as you can see. Mix, mix, mix. Mix, mix, mix. It's okay. And that's what I do, guys. Eventually, I'm going to pour this on there, but I just want to brown the meat a little bit more. So, guys, this is what the... Guys, watch your look. This is what the steaks are looking like, and then I'm going to throw my sauce on top of it now and um, cook them down. Because they're pretty much... They are thick, they are thick steaks. So it's going to take a while to cook through them, but we're going to gonna pour our seasoning. Let's see. Oh, maybe I could add a little bit more water. So I've gone ahead and added some oil. You can kind of see it floating around, olive oil. And I'm going to try to pour it all over. That's what that looks like, and we'll cook it down, and I'll show you, I guess, what the end product is, what the end result is, okay? Hi. Look, Zoza's Say having cheese. her camera shoot done, and we just... Is that out the way now? She's oh. oh, we just dressed Oopsie. her up in this cute outfit because she pooped oh, no. up her last one. Huh, Zozo, did you poop up your last outfit? Say no, I didn't. Zozo, did you? Ah, Yeah. Hi. She pooped up her last outfit, so we got to dress she, her up. Technically, she started peeing it up. She peed it up and then, and then pooped it up. And then I called, <laughs> called you to come and help, and what did you see? I saw, like, she just oh. started she started immediately pooping as soon as Mom's like, oh, my goodness, she just peed everywhere, and I and come I over, her, I and then she up. lifts her up, and then all of a sudden she just starts pooping. <laughs> <laughs> and then Mom's holding her, and I'm like, do you need help? And she's like, yes, I do need help. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? She just pooped everywhere. <laughs> I did not say it like that. No, you didn't. I'm just messing with you. <laughs> oh, you think you're here? I want to take some oh, pictures. Hi. Why do I have to hold the camera? Hi. There's mom now. See ya, people. Yeah, she had an accident. She pooped oh, everywhere, oh, oh, guys. Oh, um, She pooped. She started oh, peeing, and then I was trying to just wipe her up, and then, ugh. Kill but like this the good thing is, she, she, moving all over the place. she also pooped this morning, <laughs> and so the good thing is that, um, I have that stain remover thing, and I'm praying that it works because I've been using it since yesterday. Okay, she's, she's motioning to me it. that she is that hungry. She's hungry, yeah. Yeah, she's leaning in for the count. Okay, I will see you all later. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, look at this picture. Guys, I just flipped these babies, and they are very soft. You can see that one over there falling off of the bone. It's very juicy. So 
This one is a little bit bigger over here and it's going to take a little bit longer to, like it's obviously very tender, but it's going to take a little bit longer to tenderize. So I'm just cooking it down. And at the end, I'm just going to then um, increase the temperature, turn it up on high and just kind of uh, fry it to, so the, the sauce can kind of um, caramelize. Yeah, oh no, it does taste good. Like with the steak, it makes it taste some caramel. Hi guys, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to join the tribe. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. <laughs>